watching a lot of plus size women go through a body change is really bothering me, not because they're losing weight, but because I feel like it's been done in a very irresponsible way. Hey everyone, I feel like I can speak about this because I've been through it myself. I used to be overweight and I've been working on losing weight for years. I did it naturally at first, then gained it back and more. Two years ago, I had weight loss surgery and now I'm focused on keeping it off, which is a whole journey itself. Well, in itself. On top of that, I deal with conditions like PCOS, endometriosis, and fibroids, which can make it even harder to manage or maintain my weight loss goal. Anyway, I came across a video on my FYP that kind of resonated with me, and I agree with what the lady in this video said and some of the people that commented under her video. When I first started my YouTube journey, I was figuring out what kind of videos to make. At first, I thought about focusing on being plus size, like talking about plus size fashion, modeling, stuff like that. But then I realized I needed to work on my health. Even though I was getting backhanded compliments like, girl, you wasn't even that big. Uh, I'm five foot seven and I was weighing 251 pounds. Yeah, I was big. But anyway, I realized I had to work on my health. So I didn't think it was a good idea to make content about being plus size anymore because I'm not going to be the same person and it wouldn't be fair to my audience. Like, how can I preach about being body positivity and being proud to be plus size and all that woo woo when I'm about to change all that in a couple months. So I do agree with her on that. But then on the other hand, I forgot another thing. She made a good point about creators using their platform to talk about positivity, body positivity, growing their audience and making money, but then changing their message. I understand that. But the part that I'm disagreeing with you on is no one owes you anything. If somebody wants to change their body, they have the right to change their body. And look, I'm not even saying that in a horrible way. I'm just saying like how everybody was saying in the comments, no one owes you anything. And if somebody wants to change their body, then they have the right to change their body. But like you said, people come on social media, portraying themselves a certain way, making money, building an audience, having a message. And then once they lose the weight, the whole message changes. That's why when I was thinking about Lizzo, and how Lizzo built her, her brand, her audience off of body positivity and being plus size. I know for sure if she chooses to lose all that weight, her audience is going to flip on her. But what I understood from her video is how can these platforms promote loving yourself as you are, embracing your plus size body, but then suddenly change their message without telling their audience? The audience that they had before when they were big. Maybe that means that some people enjoy living vicariously through others or having someone to admire. I don't know.